Uh, welcome back. Um, today I'm going to share with you another um, pair of shoes from our collection. And this is actually, as of right now, our only um, Bally shoe. And this shoe, I got it because it's um, it's very unusual. And that's one of the things that I like about... Um, that's one of the things in my style. Um, so this is the serial number in case you want to get it. It's a um, Bally Salinger um, 60. It comes with um, warranty details and material details. It only, I think it only comes with one dust bag. Yes, one dust bag. And typical packaging. I think one of the things about their brand, I think it's supposed to, um, I heard another YouTuber talk about how these are uh, representing the mountains in Switzerland. Because Valley is a um, brand from Switzerland. So it's like a subliminal um, message. It's supposed to represent the mountains and the sun or the moon. I don't really know. But you see, it was interesting when I heard it from this other uh, YouTuber. So these are the shoes. They're very um, unusual looking. Like I said, the, online the description is um, dress shoe slash um, hiking shoe hybrid um, casual shoe hybrid. Um, the shoelaces are amazing. I would even add this is also like a bowling shoe. Um, I'm, I'm, at first, I didn't want to get them because I didn't know how to style them. But then Miss Corona said this would look great with uh, blue jeans and a white t-shirt. And I agree. So I'm going to, these are not going to be, I'm not going to use them for formal wear. I'm going to use them more uh, dressed down casual. And, um, and I'm going to give you um, a tour of the shoe. So shoelaces all the way to the toe box. This is the first thing that caught my attention. And fat shoelaces. Uh, this part I think is kind of like uh, reminiscent of a hiking shoe. Look at the studs. Um, similar to like a, what you see on a snow boot or a, or a hiking shoe. They're, they're not whole cuts, obviously, because you can see the seam right here. But they do kind of seem, it's like one... It's like two pieces of leather all around this leather panel. And on the heel, it has this other piece of leather that is has a different finish. It's very nice. It has a little bit of branding right here. And I think this is damaged. Um, and then the web and fashion laces. This is the, the other one with the um, same detail in the back, branding and leather sole. Made in Switzerland and the sizes the hill. I wonder if this is part of the design. It probably is. It has a little mark right here. I wonder if this is like traditional Bally branding. Right. Okay. So if you've seen other um, the other videos from our channel, you know that one of the things I like to do is show you the inside. And so here we go. Hopefully it's not difficult to put the shoelaces back. I'm considering using other type of shoelaces, the same width, but uh, maybe a different color, maybe red. 
So here's the metastats uh, eye links and some more of that fancy leather finish. in the inside. This is the model number, I guess. Yeah, it is. Salinger 60, US 9.5. They are true to size. Um, this is an excellent shoe for formal or casual, not necessarily too formal, but um, um, casual locations. And the inside, like most designer shoes that I that I like, uh, it has leather lining. The insole is not removable, unfortunately, but they have a nice um, fit. Um, the the leather is really soft, so um, there's no breaking in uh, time on this shoe. Uh, I'm very happy with the with the acquisition. And one last tour of the of the um, shoe. Again, two box shoelaces all the way to to the toes. Um, leather panel. I'm curious about this. I'm gonna try to um, see if I can clean that. Um, back counter with Bally uh, web. A little bit of branding here. And nice. Um, Side panel, leather, leather sole, a little bit of branding on the sole, and rubber heel. That's it. Um, let me know if you have any questions. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to click like and subscribe.